These retired Milwaukee police officers all have more than 20 years experience, have all faced life or death situations on the job, and all have different opinions regarding Officer Mensa and Alvin Cole. The DA said that Officer Mensa was justified in shooting and killing Alvin Cole. Do you agree? I agree. That's not something that, you know, that you, I would wish anyone to be in because it, it was a very tough situation. Uh, Alvin Cole was on his, his, his knees and maybe even his hands and knees. Ten seconds later, uh, Mensa comes up and shoots him in the back. To me, that was bad judgment because, uh, again, the other officers did not feel that they were in danger. What would you have done? If I'm put in that position, it is my determination about whether I'm fearful for my life or someone else's, and that's the decision I'm going to make. But the whole reason that there was even a decision to begin with to be made was because of the actions of a 17-year-old that was at a mall with a gun that this community doesn't seem to want to talk about. I think race definitely came in, into the picture. Uh, I think that if I had been there, and I know some other officers that had been there in Mensa's position that uh, Alvin Cole would still be alive. You know, just on the fact that we probably wouldn't have had that, that fear and uh, we probably wouldn't have objectified uh, Mr. Cole. Officer Mensa is a black man. Alvin Cole was a black teen. It's interesting that you use the word fear in there. You can't just look at skin color. You have to look at culture and life experience. Uh, uh, Officer Mensa, I don't think he grew up in like an urban or a hood environment. Do you think that he should have been fired do you agree with his resignation? To me, Officer Menzies should be in jail. I think that he would kill again, and I think that he's going to kill again. I think that he's going to find a way to kill somebody else. I think that his resignation was a wise thing, but at the same point, I'm sure he got paid very well to make that decision. Caroline joins us now live from outside the Wauwatosa Police Department. Caroline, very interesting conversation, and it was part of a much broader conversation. It really was, Joyce. These officers had fantastic insight into this case based off their extensive experience in policing. We didn't have enough time to get into that with our story tonight, but we do have that entire conversation posted on our website at WYSN.com. Go take a look. They have that perspective. Caroline Reinwald reporting live.